With the border policy, Title 42 expiring tomorrow night, cities such as Denver, Colorado are getting ready for an increase in migrant arrivals. Denver Mayor Michael Hancock plans to reactivate the city's emergency operations center to deal with an influx of migrants that are already overwhelming nonprofit partners. Hundreds of migrants have come into the city for intake processing, shelter and food, which has prompted a variety of local groups to organize efforts to provide shelter and bring food and supplies to a migrant intake center. The Food Bank of the Rockies was able to arrange food supplies for the migrants with a quick turnaround time. And for Food Bank of the Rockies, making the migrants feel at home with the food selection was just as important as making sure they were fed. Title 42 is part of U.S. laws that deal with public health, social welfare, and civil rights, giving the federal government the authority to take action to keep diseases out of the country. Trump used the law when the coronavirus pandemic broke out to prevent the spread. This allowing the Trump administration to expel migrants more quickly without having to be considered for asylum. This has been continued through the Biden administration. One Colorado representative sharing openly about how she feels about the Biden administration. She reads, they're making you believe that without Title 42, our country has zero mechanism to expel illegals. Followed by, they're going to destroy this country because they refuse to enforce the laws on the books. Later today, an immediate release sent out by Colorado Senators Hickenlooper and Bennett asked for the U.S. Department of Homeland Security to support the state of Colorado as Title 42 is lifted, stating Denver shelters are nearly full and the city is trying their best to accommodate. 